Terry Gordy is considered one of the most naturally gifted big men in wrestling history. Yeah. Uh, legit heavyweight who can move around like a gazelle. Um, yeah. Can you talk to us a little bit about your experiences with Terry in and out of the oh, ring? Bam Bam was awesome, man. He was such a, such a gifted man. You know, and uh, he started in the business incredibly young. Mm. I think he was like 14. Damn. Yeah. I didn't yeah. realize that. Yeah. 14. So, I mean, do you think it, it boils down to him being just a naturally gifted big guy, or was it like, was he the beneficiary of all those years and years of learning? Well, years of work, too. But mm -hmm. you put those together, and then you throw Michael. But really, the key to that team was Buddy. Really? Buddy was the one that went out and did the, the grind work. You know, he went out and did the, the hard shit. You know, he's the one that went out and got bumped. You know, he didn't bump Michael around much till the, till the end of the match. Mm -hmm. And you damn sure didn't bump Bam Bam. You know, it's interesting because Buddy is not the guy who's talked about most of the time when the favorites no, come up. It's all about Michael and Terry. He's the one that made that team work. The workhorse. Yeah. Yeah, Absolutely. Um, do you recall when the first time you would have crossed paths with him would have been? I know he was kind of a journeyman. Buddy? Yeah. Uh, the late 60s. Wow, before, that early. Before I ever got into wrestling. No shit. So he came yeah. into the same territory as your dad, presumably? Yeah. 